Okay, it looks like we are just about good to go. How's everybody doing? Everything coming through okay? Sounds like the volume's a little bit low. Although it's just ambience. Uh, we'll see. We'll see, I guess. Is the ambience of the game coming through all right? Because I doubt there's gonna be much music in a game like this. Good to see you. How are you doing? Oh, I'm so freaking busy. Guys, if you've got extra money, I would recommend maybe freezing some meat so that way in case everything goes to hell again, uh, you'll have something in the freezer that you can just thaw out and make whenever you want. Um, I've got I've got a bad feeling about the way some of the, the meat factories are going, at least here in the US. Maybe it's different in your guys' countries, but yeah, just my little two cents. And so we've been taking more precautions just in case uh, there's more flare-ups that shut everything down. You're good. This reminds you of Barbie Detective. Oh, God. Oh, not enough freezer space. Yeah, isn't that always how it goes? Okay, so let me see. Is this... Wait a minute. Does this work with controller? That would be super cool if it did. No, it does not. Ah, that's a shame. Okay, well, in that case, I guess I'll just turn that off and grab the mouse. Hmm. Trying to watch stream while talking to a client. Oh, boy. Well... You'll have your work cut out for you. So, uh, the developers of the game that I played a little while ago called Akamanto um, made this game and sent me a, a little uh, key for it, so just, you know, so you're aware. Um, looks like it's going to be pretty scary, honestly. Uh, <laughs> So, yeah, uh, I don't know much about it. Uh, from what I understand, we are uh, we lost a bet or something, so we're going into a school to, I guess, steal the exams and what the questions and answers will be. And there's different uh, endings depending on the choices you make. Uh, the, a game lasts around 45 minutes, although knowing me, it's probably gonna be longer. And yeah, that's just about all I know. You have to go back to work on Monday at a British Walmart, and uh, you're really worried? Yeah, yeah, uh, good luck with that. Uh, hopefully they've got little sneeze guard uh, plates of, uh, like, plastic. Uh, that I, I went to Costco and Walmart for the first time in, like, two months yesterday, and uh, they, they kind of set that up to protect people. Oh, what, breaking into the school during ni the night? I never imagined I'd do such a thing, but this situation requires it. If my family ever finds out, soon we'll be in exams time. My classmates and I are swamped with books and homework, but not just that, our teachers keep pushing us to do even more. At first, it looked like a joke, but it seems to be real. I've lost a bet and I must get into the school during the night. Once inside, I need to find the exams and get their answers. I hope everything goes fine. I wouldn't like to find anything weird. Well, I have a feeling that's exactly what we're going to find. Oh, you're not late. We just started. No worries there. Hmm. I'm noticing a little bit of hitching. Yeah, that's not good. Hang on. Let me, uh, let me adjust something really quick here. Because I don't want that interfering with, with the game if something's trying to kill me. Uh, just a Okay, yeah, sorry about that. I have um, a USB extension thing, and one of them works, and the other one doesn't. I mean, it works, but it's really spotty. So I generally like to have the one that works best for the mouse, and then the one that doesn't work as well for the keyboard, and I had them switched uh, a little while ago. But they're back. Yeah, much better. Okay. Uh, can you guys see everything all right? Should I maybe mess with the gamma real quick? I would hate to later find that this game was a little bit too dark. Yeah, a little gamma goes a long way. Let's see, there we go, and there we go. Not too much, but that should help a little bit, a little bit I think. Okay, some music would really be nice in this game. All right. So, Chiro, there's no time to waste. And then we've got... Mitsuki, my grades rely on you. Don't disappoint me. I like these models. I've been, in my spare time, I've been wrestling with uh, some 3D models myself, and it's really hard to get the hair to look nice. Uh, especially curly hair. That's what I've been doing the past day, honestly. 
So I guess we're not going in there. Be nice if I could see something. But our views are pretty much the same at this point. Oh, I guess they're following me. Cool. No one is going to pass if we don't get those exams. Go inside the school, get the exams, and leave. Easy, isn't it? Oh, well, they're just following me everywhere. You know what? Screw this. We're leaving, guys. I'm too cool for this. I mean, we all may fail and uh, work at the worst place for the rest of our lives, but, y you know. Actually, is there a way for me to leave? They're not going to kill me if I leave, right? This is just spooky as heck. Hey. By the way, can you hear the footsteps? Is that too loud? I'm not really sure on my end. I don't feel like drinking anything. Well, what's the point in them? Oh, God, these guys are kind of scaring me, actually. You don't hear any footsteps? There's nothing except for footsteps, pretty much. Um, tell you what, let me just turn this up a bunch. Here we go. You hear those? I turned it up a whole bunch, so this is probably going to screw me the minute something scary pops up. Okay, there's just nowhere to go, honestly. And I can't sprint either, by the way. And these street lights really don't do much. Yeah, we're taller than everything else. Okay, you can hear it. Great, great. What about you? What are the emails for? Okay, I'm not sure if that translated 100%, but good effort. <laughs> Is it getting pinker? Yeah, it's kind of like a reddish pink. It's really weird, but the color reminds me of that one uh, Korean webcomic, Sweet Home, where everything's, you know how they say uh, Deus Ex has the piss filter where everything's kind of yellow gold? Well, that, that one's got like kind of this mildew filter where everything's kind of this rusty pink. I don't think it's the best moment for drinking anything. Ugh, I'm really starting to hate you guys, honestly. I just don't like how they're always instantly behind me. I hate this. I, it, it's just slowly ranching up my anxiety. <laughs> just no music, just quietly walking with these two just ghosting behind me. Dang, Mitsuki! You're walking like we're on a catwalk here. <laughs> Maybe I can use them as sacrifices. Where is this school, by the way? I'm actually really lost. <laughs> Wait a minute. Okay. God, I, I swear, sometimes I turn around and they're not there. So, so where is the school? These are all clearly apartments. I hope I didn't just get myself lost immediately in the game. This is an alleyway. That's not good. Oh, it's just a cone. And what is this? School emblem. I have a feeling I'm going to need that. There are many of these in the neighborhood. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, so that's just where we came from. All right, I'm glad I picked that up. Um, I've actually seen a playthrough of one of their other games. I think it was by the same dev team where you were visiting a friend and supernatural shenanigans was going on and you had to like pick up a couple things in the environment to get the good ending. So I'm wondering if, if that emblem has anything. Ugh, I don't have an inventory, do I? No, I don't. Shoot. Where am I going? I'm so freaking lost. Here? No. I think this is where I started out, though. Yeah, this is the street I started out on. Okay, guys, well, it's just gonna be 20 more minutes of this. Get ready. Is this a school? No, this doesn't look like a school. That's an apartment. Wait, maybe this is a school. Maybe it's just some small town school or whatever. Guys, where is our school? Sochiro and Mitsuki. What's your prop? I can't find the freaking school, okay? <laughs> Companions remind me of how Watson teleports in one of the Sherlock Holmes games. I know exactly what you're talking about. I've seen footage of that. That's definitely something we're going to have to play for the channel one of these days. Okay, so we're on the right corner here. And I'm not seeing any school buildings. Guys, if you see a school building, please do let me know. This looks interesting. I mean... Wait, 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 wait. This looks kind of... No... No. 
no. <sighs> yeah, when, when NPCs follow, you kind of get anxious or annoyed. Yeah, it's weird. It's uncanny. I don't know why that is, but it just is. Guys, where is the freaking school? Okay, hang on. There's a sign here. Maybe this will tell us something. Oh, a map. No, it's not a map. Okay, I can't read that. the emails for. I wonder what the original uh, accurately translates to. I'm curious about that. I think I see the sky box over here, so hmm. Okay, so that's where I came. I guess we're going this way. I feel like we've gone this way before, though. Hmm. Man, this game is so realistic. You actually have to walk to the school. <laughs> yeah. And, and it's like one of those uh, elderly people's stories. Oh, it was just a random street. Okay, back in my day, it took me 20 minutes to figure out where the school was because it kept changing. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, let me out. Let me out. Have you got a flashlight? You'll probably need it. No, I don't have a flashlight. Did you bring one? Come on. Now go inside the school and find the exams. I hate this. I hate you guys. I'm going to die in here, okay? I wouldn't like to go in the school right now. Also, how tall am I? Oh my god, Michael Roberts. 20 monies. Greetings from Australia. Love your playthroughs. Very chill, even during horror. I don't feel very chill right now, but I'm glad you guys are having a chill time. <laughs> I'm, I'm just slowly getting worse and worse here. It should be in any of the classrooms, okay? I don't have a flashlight. I, I'm hearing something creaking in the distance. I think it's just ambience, though. Is there graduation soon? If I die in here, I'm going to come back as a ghost and kill those guys. Name, nameless, diplomas, badges, preparations for the ceremony. Okay, so we all must be graduating soon. It's a bit weird that they left the preparations out here during the night. I never liked ceremonies. Okay. The volume is so high on my end. <laughs> Just so that you guys could hear the stupid footsteps. And I still can't run. I still can't run. Did you hear that? There's just something like... it's Again, it's gotta be ambu ambience. I almost said ambulance. But it's just, just a grinding in the distance. Like someone sliding open a metal door or something. Or a shutter. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. I'm glad I collected that school medallion. Oh, there's another one. School emblem. What are these for? People say that stepping on manholes bring bad, brings bad luck. I don't think it brings bad luck. I think there's just a chance that it'll break and you'll fall through. That's happened even, you know, in modern times. Okay. 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 It's locked. If I had a key... Oh, what? Am I gonna have to find the freaking key too? I'm getting so many Akamanto flashbacks, it's destroying me. <laughs> okay guys, if you were a key, where would they hide you? I mean, if you can't run, that means there's nothing to run from yet. Maybe, yeah, a horror game would be kind of weird if you couldn't run. Maybe it's on one of these benches, like a, a staff member sat down and left it behind. No, or a trash can or something. By the way, I'm not entirely sure if this game is in alpha or beta. I don't think it is, but it's possible. Okay, let me try by the trash again. Oh wait, maybe I can step on the manhole and then fall in and die, and then I won't have to play this. Well, I'm on it now. Come and get me. I hate this. I hate- I'm not going down. <laughs> well, I don't know if we can get into the school otherwise. Okay, maybe I have to go back and talk to my friends. What the fuck? Did you hear that? I don't know if it just unlocked behind me, or that was the sound of- You know what? I'm going- I'm gonna go check on Mitsuki and what's-his-face. I mean... Yeah, they're still there. Come to think of it, the setup is exactly like Akamanto. 
where you've got your two friends waiting outside. I suppose any of you guys have a key. Yeah, I swear I think I heard it unlock or, or rustle or someone banged on it. I don't see color, so is there just some really thick fog for- Oh, really? Yeah, it's it's a thick, thick pinkish fog. Although, you know, it doesn't matter what color it is, you know, it's it's just kind of making things hard to see through. Maybe I didn't have to step on that manhole. Maybe the key was here or something. Okay, uh, just one more time, I'm gonna go behind and check. Maybe I didn't have to step on that manhole at all and I just cursed this playthrough so I get the worst ending. Ah, oh, I didn't have to step on it. Oh god, oh god. It was completely unnecessary. Hey, Voidhead! 15 monies! Stay awesome! Thank you so much! Oh, and I know you sent me, um, something in Discord, but I haven't been, uh, on yet, so I'll, I'll have to pass the message along whenever, uh, I get to that. But thank you, thank you very much. Okay, so how do I use the key? Oh, I guess I could only use it on one of the doors. Fine. Oh god, I've been staring at the pink so long, the black loading screen looks greenish. That's nuts. Oh, I hate this. I hate this so much. Mitsuki said that the exam should be on the fourth floor. Oh god, there's four floors of this. Actually, can we just leave? I'm not going back without the exams. But first I need to find the classroom's keys of each of the floors. What? And look at the... Those keys must be in different teachers' rooms. And look at the flashlight. I think I get it. Look at the flashlight. It's so slow to follow where I'm looking. Why would you do that? Oh, that's horrible. So there's a split second where you look at something and the light follows after a second. Oh, no, 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 no. Can I run? I can't run. Okay, so that's a good sign. Right? No need to run. Okay, shoes. Lockers. Okay, so we have to go to teacher's rooms to get the keys, to get to the different floors, to get to the fourth floor, to get the exam. And then we vamoose. Oh, just let me out. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> Guys, how would you feel if I just turned this game off and started playing that one Yu-Gi-Oh game? What would the consensus be on that decision? <laughs> I wonder if I could make a living um, doing a stream where I play scary games, but the second it actually starts getting scary, I just turn it off and end the stream. <laughs> and it's just like, like that every day. Just a new game, and the second it gets spooky, I'm, I'm out of there. <laughs> I mean, it'd be good for comedy, I guess, but probably not a feasible let's play career. <laughs> okay, what are these? I see these in, um, I think White Day had them too. And they always have like a red light and stuff. Oh, I can't see down that hallway at all. Okay, stairs, cool, that's fine. Let me check the other side before I go up the stairs. I stepped on that manhole. The ghost is gonna kill me. It's a funny bit, but would get boring after about two times. Yeah, probably. Maybe for an April Fool's Day special, I'll play something really scary. But then, five minutes in. <laughs> One thing I hate is that if you're close to something, the flashlight just blinds you completely. and washes everything out. I think that was... Uh, in Akamanto, that poster there. I recognize the creepy faceless schoolgirl. Fuck. Okay, cool, fine. That opened. Can I close this? Cool. Okay. And the reticle for the flashlight is so small, I'm looking through a tunnel vision thing. That is supremely uncomfortable. Okay, that's fine. It's just a school thing. I'm sure they have that running at night, right? That's normal. Can I crouch? I can't crouch. It's freaking white day all over again. Okay, all I found was an emblem in that one room. I hate 
this. I hate this. I hate this. What if the ghost can go through closed doors? Well, Akamanto couldn't. So that's what I'm betting on. You love that our friends get to chill outside while we walk around inside with the slowest flashlight? Okay, I'm not gonna pick up that key yet. Something's gonna happen when I do. I just, I know it. I'm hearing things. I don't know if it's just, what the? Do you see that? It's some texture issue, but look at that. When I have the flashlight on, it's smooth, but if I move the flashlight off, you can kind of see um, there's a weird texture on these. It kind of looks like grainy. I mean, I don't think it's a special effect in the game. I think it's just like a, oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Damn it. <laughs> just let me talk about textures. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. That shouldn't have scared me. She shouldn't even do anything. She's just like, hi, bye. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. My heart had a jolt from that. Ah. And I haven't been exercising on quarantine, so I could probably have a heart attack and die in here. Fuck. Hey, ghosty goo. How you doing? Okay, that was probably a bad idea. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Whew. Are you remember in December? Oh, let me get some water. You remember in December, you had to go to a giant construction facility for your boss with only the flashlight from my phone. I had to go on the roof because he left his keys inside. Parkour. Well, you are braver than me, that's for sure. Didn't see any, uh, ghost girls, did ya? Hopefully not. Wait a minute. If I have the first floor key, didn't, does that mean that I can explore the classrooms on the first floor? Do I have a reason to do that? Because one was unlocked, but the others weren't. You know, with all the moonlight streaming in from the windows, I should probably be able to see better in here. Okay, I'm glad I went back. Yeah, we can we can now explore the first floor. <sighs> okay, I hate my parents. Because of their jobs, we have to keep moving and changing cities constantly. And that means I can't get into the, uh, get into any high high level school. It seems that they don't care whether their daughter gets to the top or not. This is so wrong. Is that a thing in Japan where if you move around a lot, you can't get into a good school? I hear it again. I hate that. But yeah, that was my life growing up. We moved every uh, year or so. It just keeps you from getting attached. It's not that bad. Okay, I don't see anything else in here. I wonder if that's the ghost girl's paper. All right, I'm just gonna open the doors to the places I've already been. Was this always? Yeah, this is where I got the emblem. It's locked. Well, I have the first floor key. Okay. It's weird. When you back away, the moonlight stops coming in from the windows. That is supremely weird. I swear I heard something. Oh, can you guys see a little bit um, outside of the flashlight? I don't want this to be too um, nauseating for people because I can sort of see objects outside the flashlight. I'm mostly silhouettes. I can't see them clearly, of course, but um, how's that? If you guys can't, I can always raise the gamma just a little bit more. Is there nothing in here? Just the flashlight? Okay, just a teensy bit more. Not enough to make it washed out, but... Enough to help a little bit. Okay, that should do it, I think. There we go. Maybe a bit? I really can't see much outside the flashlight either, so I guess that's closer to just what I'm seeing. Hmm. It's almost pitch black. Okay, just a little bit more. All right, how's this look? Now you can kind of, I can see on the, the viewfinder, you can kind of see the desks and the outlines of the windows outside the flashlight reticle. Whew. I'm at a friend's house with, uh, where my, with my GF and two friends are wrestling while me and GF are watching you and the friends just bumped the couch and scared the heck out of us. Oh boy, well that sounds fun. <laughs> 
At least there are people with you. Okay, so I'm gonna open that door because I've already been in that room. Guess we can't draw any butts on the chalkboards here. Oh, there's another key. Thanks to my father's contacts, I've been able to get into this school. If it wasn't for him, I'd probably be at home right now doing absolutely nothing. Teacher's room, second floor. So I did have to explore the first floor in order to get the teacher's room key for the second. Fuck. Fuck. Hello. Okay. Yeah, goodbye. I'm sweating. Why am I sweating? I hate this. Ah. Uh, my body is physically rejecting this game. Okay, the teacher's room is probably at the end of the hall. At least she glows. She doesn't blend into the darkness. Whew, okay, it's fine. It's fine. Stealing exams, moving about with a flashlight, not knowing the route. Yeah, yeah. It's fine. It's cool. We're all good. Nothing bad's gonna happen. I hope I haven't missed any of those. I am trying to be super observant. I just can't get into any of these rooms. I guess I have to get into the teacher's room first before I even have the option to get into the upper floor rooms. Okay, well that's fine. I'm sure she's not gonna spook me in here. Oh, my eye is twitching. Hang on, let me rub it. Ah. Okay. In general, students are progressing adequately, but I'm a bit worried about two of them, Ryoko and Daichi. One of them is doing pretty well, although he seems very stressed, while the other one keeps wasting time and not collaborating in, in class. Okay, she's gonna be here. I guess not. Well, good. Didn't want to see her anyway. All right, now I just go through each classroom. Just like the first floor. Except I have a feeling it's going to get worse every floor. I hate this. I hate this so much. <laughs> uh. Spending the nights working and studying is not enough to keep up with classes. Every day that goes by, I'm getting more and more left behind. If I stay at this level, I'll fail this course and disappoint my father. Well, you could just become a ghost. That's cool. What if they wedge that emblem that I'm supposed to find, like, in hard-to-see places? And I miss one. And I collect all of them but one. But because I miss the one, I'm screwed. This is a long ass school. I hate it. There's no chairs in here. Or desks, you know. This must be a joke. I just keep wasting my time by staying in a school like this one. The teacher has no idea about anything and my classmates seem like they've just finished their kindergarten. If it weren't because of my parents, I could be in an elite school. I wonder, I, I guess there's two different people is what I'm, I'm recognizing. I'm seeing some are from a pink journal and some are from a blue journal. So one is worried about failing classes and the other one is mad that they're at this school at all because their parents move around so much and they could be in a better school. Hmm. So Pink is the one that moves around a lot and blames their parents for being here. Hmm. Wonder which one's the ghost. Okay, hurry up, come and visit me. Okay, well, all right then. I haven't been in this one yet, I don't think. S 
slow-ass flashlight. What good are you? At least it's not running out of batteries, I suppose. Okay, third floor. Three out of four, guys. Wait a minute, why did I come up this way? I'm gonna have to walk down the whole freaking hall just to get to the teacher's place. Ah. She's gonna show up, I'm sure. You know what, let me get some water and look at chat. How are you guys doing? <laughs> Uh, consider suicide. No, wait, that's not what I meant by become a ghost. Uh. Ghost must be Ryoka, it looks like a girl. Yeah, probably. Ryoka's the pink journal, I think, right? The one that's uh, angry about being in the school at all, thinking she's too good for it. Well, you're fine, how are you? Okay, good, good. Don't run from the ghost cursor, you can't hide behind chat. <laughs> True enough, I suppose. Ugh, I hate this. See, this is why I play more obscure kind of mystery horror games rather than outright have a heart attack kind of horror games. I just, I don't handle them very well. And it's hard to keep my cool. Oh gosh, Bell Dark. A stay calm cursory. Yeah, stay calm. You're right. You're right. Gotta stay calm. Thank you for the five monies. That is super nice. Hope you're having a fun time and you're not too scared either. <laughs> okay, there's the key. Which means she's gonna show up, I'm sure. I wonder if reading all the journals has anything to do with the end. I stepped on that freaking manhole. I bet I sabotaged my entire freaking game. Hello. My worries about Daichi and Ryoko were right. Maybe it's time to speak with them personally or contact directly with their parents. So far, so good. I haven't seen her in a while. She doesn't look like a very scary ghost, to be honest. I wonder if she's gonna get like more warped and jacked up as we go on. Do people just leave their bags in their classroom? I saw a shape over here. I thought it was the girl in white. Ugh. I hate that. I don't want to miss any journals. Freaking Japanese schools. Way more haunted than American schools, I'll tell you that. I wonder why. Hello? See, that's why I look everywhere. Okay, it's fine, we're doing good. It's locked. What about you? Okay, thanks for nothing. Oh gosh, Avaria Vidal, 20 monies, spooky, ooky, kooky ghosts. Well, they're not very kooky. Oh fuck, what am I seeing? You're too cute to be a ghost though, is the thing. She looks like one of those uh, Hatsuhine uh, Miku um, hologram girls that dance and sing and stuff. You need to have her with not anime eyes, just make pitch black circles for eyes. Now that would scare me. I mean, she still does scare me though, what am I saying? <laughs> You'd think American schools would have more ghosts because you know. <laughs> I know, I know. But also, then again, I think... Um, is it a thing? Are, are there not suicides at Japanese schools? Wasn't there a thing where people would hang themselves in bathrooms? Or is that just corpse party? I don't know much about the culture there, so maybe that's just, you know, um, dramatization. It doesn't actually take place. Look at them. They are all wasting their time together. Don't they know that if they go on like this, they won't get anywhere in life? Why do I have to struggle like this? Why do I have to always be alone? Well, maybe because you're just kind of superior to everybody else, huh? They want to have fun with their youth. Rather than, you know, spending every waking moment studying and then dying in a job. Hello. 
I don't know if walking up to her is the best idea. She doesn't want to be alone, so I guess I'll be nice and walk over to her, but what if she hates that? What if she drags me to hell, though, because she doesn't want to be alone, and I... encouraged it by talking to her. Even though I worked and studied so hard, I ended up falling behind. I don't seem to be enough to, s it doesn't seem to be enough to stay in this school. Teachers have decided to ignore me, but not just that, my classmates spend their days pointing and mocking me. Okay. Okay, great, love it. Ugh, oh, why am I, I should stop going on this side though, because then I have to walk through the whole freaking hallway before I can even open any freaking doors. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Last floor. It doesn't go any higher. It's locked. Also, this entire school is just one long line. Is that a normal design? I don't think American schools do that. They're usually very winding and full of different hallways. Not that I'm complaining. I certainly don't want a maze to deal with. But yeah, this entire school is just straight up horizontal. What is that? I hate it. I hate it. Oh man, I haven't been... What if the an emblem was to the right and I missed it? Ah. Okay, okay, we're fine. I see the notebook. This is a green, oh, the teacher's notebook, that's right. Okay, albeit the good results, Daichi confessed that his family was not happy enough with them. It seems that he is getting much pressure from his parents. About Ryoko, I had to speak directly to her parents. They've told me that they had to move from different cities trying to find a school where Ryoko could stay. They haven't been able to uh, let her integrate or study. Do we have a problem with the current education? Should we treat every student differently and in a personal way? I mean, yeah, different students are going to have different needs. It's it's not a one-size-fits-all one system, but the problem is when you have thousands and thousands going through the school every day, uh, you can't give all of them the personal attention that you maybe could in a small town where each teacher only had, like, five kids to worry about. Okay, here we go. Hey ghost, you should you should um, be sympathetic towards me. I'm here stealing exams because I suck so bad. So you know we should we should be comrades against the school system, right? Fight the power and all that. Okay, more water, more water. Okay, something's gonna happen. This is the last thing. <sighs> American schools. Bell rings, dog salivates, change places. Yep, yep, everyone loves to hear the, the end of the period bell, so you could get up and go somewhere else. <laughs> Your school in Southern California was all trailers and no permanent structures. I had a class like that. I spent the entire um, couple years just because of, well, it was the same teacher and the same kind of class, but she taught different subjects within that, you know, category. It was criminal justice, and we just were always out in the freaking trailer for that one for all my four years. I think they still have the education policy that if you're stuck at school, you're basically fucked for life with no future. Yeah, yeah. Although, I guess the good news is you can always try and graduate again, I suppose. You can always retake the SAT. That's one thing I like. I've, I've always heard that in some places, I think maybe it was Germany, isn't there some big test? And then however you do in that test, it d d decides what kind of jobs you can get. I don't know if that's a rumor or if that's just an old thing or if this is completely wrong, but yeah. How are you? Oh, I'm scary. The game ends with the ghost giving you the test answers. Yeah, she just, like, um, pops up behind you and no one else can see her. And she's just like, oh, no, it's that one. It's B. And you're like, yeah, thanks. Okay. She's going to kill me. She's going to flat up kill me. Ah, be nice. I'm just a kid. Why are all these locked?
I can't do anything. I'm just an obstacle for my family, my teachers, and my classmates. I wish I had more capabilities to keep up with everyone else, but unfortunately it's not like that. I better quit my studies and find other ways to earn a living. I mean, you can still keep trying, but you may want to go into like a manual trade skill or something. I mean, half the time, don't trade schools actually get you better jobs than some college degrees these days? Study classroom. All right, that must have been one of the locked ones that I passed by. But just in case, I'm going to look at the last one anyway. I bet there's something in there, because they know that most people will turn back and go to the other one. Yeah, fuck. Hey. Okay. Oh, what the? This is a bad room. But I have to know. Waste of time, waste of time. Hours and days fly by while I waste my time. Waste of time. I won't make it to this, the top. <laughs> Start playing Clocks by Coldplay. <laughs> uh, Alright, study room it is. Um, I don't think I missed anything, so that's good news. I need to figure out how many emblems there are if I miss them in the first playthrough. Yeah, trade drops. There's always... What was that? Was that on my end or the game's end? Um, trade jobs, there's always demand for certain trades, you know, and not always demand for certain degrees. Okay, that's locked, and... Yeah, I've, the windows that you can't see through are usually for locked doors. Maybe I have to not take the exam papers. Can I just wedge myself in the locker? When you get bullied so bad, even the ghost is shoving you into lockers. Yeah, an emblem. That would have been hard to find. Glad I just procrastinate and wander around a bit. <laughs> okay, before things get real, I'm just gonna get some water and I'm gonna look and see what you guys have to say. You're still 19, maybe you should check out some technical schools. Yeah, it depends on what you're passionate about. I mean, if you're not interested in technical schools, then, you know, nothing to it. The good news is we've got internet and YouTube and, and other study sites that really can give you a dose of information. Not saying that it can give you everything you could get in a school, but it could at least give you a leg up. So if you ever do take classes or go into the, you know, the trade school, you, you know, you kind of have an edge over other people. So we we'll always need plumbers and grave diggers. Absolutely. Ghost doesn't like you talking about trade jobs. <laughs> uh. Homeschooled students outperform public and private school students in all categories. Something to do with people giving a shit about them. Yeah, yeah, the only thing about homeschool is I, I've had a lot of homeschooled friends growing up. They're usually lacking in the, the wheeling and dealing department, the charisma department, the, the um, social department. And sometimes I think uh, the people that are able to schmooze and network make it farther than the people that actually know their stuff, if you know what I'm saying. So it's, it's, uh, you know. And one thing about school is that it does teach you to deal with all sorts of people, you know, nasty people, people out to get you, people that are indifferent, people that just, you know, have something to gain from, you know, taking you down a peg versus the ones that just casually are cruel for no reason. So yeah, I think school is important in that one way. It teaches you to deal with horrible people. And you either learn from it, hopefully, ideally, or you don't. Got them. Time to go back. If you say so. That ghost is gonna give me hell. Nope. Oh, the middle staircase. I got lucky. Hello. Do I need to, like, go anywhere else to do something extra? I sure hope not. Fuck. I know she's coming. I don't know why it scares me. Just focus. Hey. Just let me out. Just let me out. Just let me out. Stop, you violated the law. <laughs> then pay with your blood. I don't know if anything of what I saw or read in the school was real. In any case, I've got the exams, so it's time to go back to Mitsuki and Sochiro. Oh yeah, come to think of it, I turned off the scan lines for the, the special effects scan lines, so you guys actually didn't see the grainy, um, 
line things. Achievement F. Listen, I tried really hard. Next day, the teachers gathered, the three of us. We were told that someone had informed them during the night that we broke into the school. That fucking ghost rat, you narc. As a punishment, we would have a penalty in our final grades, and they would also inform our parents to tell them what happened. The exam's content would be changed as well, so we screwed our whole class, basically. How is that possible? Who blew the whistle? In any case, I'd better get ready for when I come back home. <laughs> Ghost snitch. Yeah, she ratted us out. F for Frankly, I think you were too cowardly. Yeah, no kidding. Well, we didn't die, and at the end of the day, that's what matters. Thanks for playing. Okay, we're going to replay that. And now that I know that nothing's out to eat my flesh, um, maybe we can get a better uh, better ending. Yeah, here, let me show you what the options look like with the TV scan lines. See? <laughs> Would you rather have it look like that? Okay, let me go see what I have to do differently. I, I got the ending that I would have gotten, you know, uh, doing what I did. And now it's time to give you something completely different, ending-wise, hopefully. Okay. I still really if, uh, expected something like an Akamanto to just come out and just kill me. Da -da -da -da. Okay. Hmm. Ghost is the teacher's pet. <laughs> Ghost is, uh, wait, no, 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 no. There was an emblem on one of the teacher's desks. Oh, did I miss it? Girl killed herself so she could become the security for the school. Uh... Okay, so I did get the bad end. It looks like there's two different endings, actually. Man, I should play Convenience Store. Isn't that by the same people? Hmm. Yeah, so that was the bad ending. It looks like there's only two endings, so I, I can absolutely uh, do this. Oh, and the, the name of the game is like Exam Hell or Examination Hell. So that's what the Japanese name means. Because I stood on that freaking manhole cover, wasn't it? Hmm. Oh, I could do a stream break right now, I suppose. R.I.P. to Ghost Girl, who's about to get killed for the second time. Snitches get stitches. The good ending is when you die, but don't get expelled. <laughs> Okay, tell you what, yeah, let me go ahead, since I'm still taking a while to track down how to get the good ending, um, I'll just go and do a stream break, and you guys can go get a refill, whatever it is you need to do, and, yeah. There we go. Alright, see you guys in about four minutes, I guess. Hopefully.
we are back. So much thanks to a site called Game Pretty. They seem to have um, what we need to do in order to get the best ending. Now, um, yeah, so we're going to be able to... Oh, it turns out I got an F because you left doors open behind you. Come to think of it, that's probably what gave me away, although I'm not 100% sure. Also, I know for a fact we didn't read every single notebook because I didn't get the scholar achievement, so that's definitely something we're going to have to do. Um, let's see. There's also a secret room that we can get into. Oh gosh, all run, five monies. God, my alarm didn't go off. What did I miss? Just me freaking out for 30 minutes that a ghost was going to kill me when all it did was rat me out to the freaking teacher and get my uh, exam score messed up. That's all that happened. I'm about to replay it and hopefully get a better ending. So trust me, you, you haven't missed much at all. Okay, so we're going to replay. Uh, because I'm trying to hunt things down and see things, let me go ahead and get rid of this. Because this just makes it so freaking hard to see. Okay, here we go. Good ending time, yeah. Are you pondering what I'm pondering? <laughs> I, I don't know. You'll, you'll have to say it and we'll, we'll know. Okay, so we've seen all this. Speedrun, stay calm. Yeah, it turns out I missed a couple here in the village. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Also, you get an achievement if you interact with things 30 times. So, that's cool. Are their eyes actually sculpted on, or are they a texture? Let me see. Yeah, it looks like the lashes and, and eyebrow are, are probably 3D, but it looks like otherwise the eyes are... are um, 2D. Okay, so it said something about going left. Yeah, where is the first... Go to the very left street and follow all the way until you get to this dark area behind them. Okay. Wait, is this left, technically? I, I don't know. Okay, the vending machines are gonna show up over there. God, I wish I could run. If you beat the game once, you should let us run. <laughs> Because we already know nothing's going to kill us. Although I'm not entirely sure what causes you to get the best ending. Oh god, another manhole. Yeah, well, I'm not stepping on that. Well, I've gone the wrong way. Oh god, you idiots. <laughs> Freaking scared me again. Maybe I'll make them walk on the manhole, huh? How about you guys walk on the manhole? That's right. You're pondering that they should make a video game based off of Earth Girls Are Easy. Can't say I've ever seen that. I believe that's a movie, right? Yeah, unfortunately, haven't quite seen that. Okay, where is this freaking... Okay, it's clearly some dark corner. Dark area with a pole to the right. That's what we're looking for. Well, this is where we are right now, guys. <laughs> Ah, it's here. That's right. I recognize this. Okay, so it's in the corner here. Alright, that's one emblem. One emblem down, like freaking 20 to go. Oy. Okay, the second one is go down the middle street and look for a little alleyway. Yeah. Middle street alleyway. I can do that. Don't get close to manholes. That's bad luck. Yeah, clearly. I also know there was one by the vending machines. That way leads to the school, I'm pretty sure. Middle Street. So it said Middle Street. I guess this is a Middle Street. Worst case, I turn around and go down the, the street behind me. Okay, this is a little alleyway. Another freaking manhole. I've always been afraid of sewers. It looks kind of pink for you guys because of the gamma, but that'll disappear as soon as we get into the school. Okay, well this was not what I... Let me have another look at what this looks like. 
Okay, it'll have, the entrance will have a street light to the left of it. Street light to the left. And also a trash can by the vending machine will have a medallion too. Didn't you know that manhole covers have been known to break games? Have they really? What's so special about them that they broke games? Yeah, that is news to me. Okay, we're gonna go down this way of the middle of the street. We've been building a rough replica of the eerie building from gargoyles together and it's been calming. The stress from finals is straining though, just one week until it's over. Are people still pushing on with finals despite everything that's happened this year? I mean, I guess, you know, everything still keeps going, but still. Seems really rough on the people that have uh, had their studies interrupted by this uh, outbreak. Huh. Okay. The alleyway's gonna have a street light. Yeah, okay, so it is still a final. Well, shucks, that's not very cool. I'm sorry, guys. Hopefully you've been able to get some study time in. Okay, so there's one right there. Okay, so that's, but what about the other one? Oh, that was it. Okay, school grounds. Okay, so there was, there was two before you get to the school grounds. All right. I guess I didn't read it clearly, um, because basically it says that the alleyway leads to the vending machines. It's not that there's a vending machine one and an alleyway one, it's just that the alleyway leads to the vending machines, so, cool. Alright, I think this way leads to the school. Once we get to the school, there'll be some new ones we can try and collect. I heard from my friends in their high school they'll not get a high school graduation. Yeah, where I live, I think the same thing too. They're not actually holding a ceremony. They're just, I think, mailing them out. Heard NY med students don't have a final. Straight to the field you go. Yeah, I've heard that too. They've had to do that in Italy just due to all the doctors um, taking ill or dying. So that's uh, pretty scary. I don't really care about the collector achievement. I just, I'm worried that that'll play a part in whether or not I'm able to beat the game with a good ending. I don't think it is, but you know. Okay, we'll give it like three more and then I'll go in. They said the easiest way to get the collector thing is just to interact with your friends 30 times. You know, just spam the interaction button and then, you know. You know what's real suspicious, guys? You guys standing out here in front of the school at night. How about you just come in with me and you guys won't look so suspicious, huh? Okay, well, that's enough. So there's an emblem by the trash can, I think this way. Also, there's a key I need. That's how you make friends, just spam them, mm-hmm. Yeah, the way to a person's heart is through spam. They did? How come I didn't know that? I live in Italy. Yeah, if you Google um, Italian med students or Italian medical students, uh, you'll probably see something like that. I know medical, uh, the people in the medical field are being hit really hard right now, not just in Italy, but I guess a lot of other places too. Bang, okay, that's the third medallion. The fourth medallion is gonna be right after class one three in one of the corners. Okay, cool, that ghost better watch out. She won't be snitching on me this time. Don't let me forget about the secret classroom that we can go into. <sighs> Back again. At least I'm not terrified this time. Okay, one, three. Oh, they do have uh, numbers. Wait, <sighs> gone the wrong way. Okay, so that means 1-3 is going to be on the left, which is weird because you think it would go from left to right, but instead it's going from right to left. Hmm. I 
I'm from America and in Michigan they are protesting the lockdown by blocking traffic. I've seen that. I've always had really mixed feelings about protests um, because it's like really taking it out on people that have nothing to do with your cause isn't going to help your cause much. In fact, if I were trying to get to my job and I got chewed out by my boss because you know, somebody was blocking the traffic and screaming that, you know, they wanted things a certain way, I would go out of my way to be like, nope, I don't support that at all. In fact, I'm going to do the opposite of what you guys are protesting for, just out of, like, sheer spiteness, depending on my mood. But yeah, I get it. They, they, they want everything to be okay. They want everything to go back to normal. But the problem is, I don't think you're going to get that by protesting, because a disease doesn't really care about what you want. What the heck? Okay, hang on. It will be in the classroom right after class 1-3. Okay, well, dumb. I thought it was in the hallway. The picture makes it look like it's in the hallway. Should we organize a protest against protests? Absolutely. Everybody into the street. Just step in front of every car that you can see. Just kidding. Don't do that. And just let everybody know how mad you are and that you're protesting the protests. Okay. Oh my god, this was the first teacher's notebook. I guess I missed it. <sighs> Dumb. Because uh, I didn't know the notebooks was a thing yet. All right, S. Daichi, recommended student by Principal Nakamura. Seems that he had a very good score, uh, he had very good scores in his last school. T. Ryoko, interchange student from the Hasegawa School. She has changed school numerous times during the last years. Okay, so I'm guessing there's a teacher's notebook in every single teacher's room. So there's probably gonna be four total. I can't believe I missed that. Oh, it burns me up. Okay, the secret room's on the third floor, so otherwise I'll just... Okay, so this is room 1-3, and the emblem is in one of the corners, if I'm not mistaken. All right, there's the notebook. I hate my parents. Great. Thanks, Ryoko. You freaking snitch. I wouldn't love my child either if they were a snitch. <laughs> okay, it's in here somewhere. It said it's in a corner. What was that? I'm sure it was just the flashlight moving around. I'm sure it was nothing. Oh wait, maybe it said the classroom after 1-3. Let me take a look here. Why is everything so hard to find? It will be in the classroom right after 1-3 in one of the corners. Okay, well, fair enough. There's no key here, just the book, and I've got the book. You know what? I'm gonna close the door behind me. Shoot, I missed that one teacher's door. I had to do that over there too. I don't really care about the achievement, but I'm not sure which achievements uh, let you get the, the good ending. Stupid. Okay. One, three. Okay, closed. And closed. Alright, this one has an emblem. Yep, alright, we've been in here before. No notebooks that I can see. I'm sure it's the notebooks that decide what ending you get. Oh, and by the way, if you're if you're expecting like a really cool ending or something, it's just going to be um, a flat screen with some text on it, which personally I really hate. But hey, you know, you, you do what you're capable of, right? Did I close that other door behind me? I don't actually know if I closed that door behind me. I did, I did. Good job, me. Yep, this is the one. Okay. Ah, I just don't want to go through all this trouble and then miss one door and then get the bad ending. Okay, where's the next emblem? Second floor. Okay, so I just have to worry about the journals then. But what about the journals? That's the one I really have to pay attention to. There's not as many as I thought there would be. It doesn't say anything about the journals, unfortunately. Let me know if you guys see anything. It 
does this room not have anything in it? Because I'm beginning to think each floor has one journal from Daichi and one journal from Ryoko. And this doesn't have any ones. Okay, maybe it's in the next, maybe it's in the next classroom. Yeah, forget it. I'll check the next classroom, I guess. All right, close. It's a walking simulator. Yeah, kind of like go, Gone Home. There we go, Daichi. So thanks to his father, con father's contacts, he was able to get into the school. I don't have to look around for an emblem because I know the next one's on the second floor, so we close that. Great. All right, one down, three to go. We'll see if we can't beat this in under two hours. I mean, in under a two hour stream. All right, screw it. I'm just going down to the end of the hall. I'll open all the doors on my way back. What's the story? No one cares, just walk. <laughs> well, see, you get the story by walking to places and getting pieces of it, which I actually don't mind walking simulators as uh, much as uh, most people do. But the thing is, you really have to be careful at making the story interesting, or it has to be more than just walking. Like if I make four rooms and each one has a bit of a story on a piece of paper and the entire game is just walking from room one to read the paper to room two to read the paper, three and then four and then the game's over, it doesn't really matter how good the story on the papers are because you need more in a game, you know, to, to really kind of capture people's uh, imaginations. Like you need characters, you need to break up the walking with stuff, like maybe mini games or something. That's just my opinion, though. It's not to say that walking simulators are, you know, not good. I just think there's ways to, to, to make them feel less like walking simulators and more like an actual story, if even, you know, narratively heavy more than anything else. Okay. Okay, one of them's not doing well, the other's really standoffish. Okay. Good job, Ryoko. I like the art here. I don't know, it's just nice. I don't know what it is about Japanese art, but they're able to do cute things in a way that I really haven't seen um, any other country do really that well. All right, Daichi's worried about being left behind and disappointing his father. Okay, let me see if there's any other emblems. Six is in three, three. Okay, so that'll be on the third floor. I felt like there were way more of those, but I guess there's only one on each floor. Ah, I gotta close that day. I can't even leave through the, the other door. I have to come back through this one just so I can shut it. Weeb. <laughs> what can I say? They make cute characters. This one, I think there's a secret room here. Right, do I click on the poster or do I click on the door? I'm supposed to click on something. Or do I have the wrong spot? All right, I'm gonna give it another like five seconds. Yeah, I must have the wrong spot. Where's that secret classroom? Third floor. Guys, are we on the third floor? I don't think we're on the third floor. That's probably why it's not opening. Okay, I just wasted everyone's time. Cool. Wait, this will tell me. Yep, we're on the second floor. That's what the problem is. Okay, Ryoko. I get it. You're better than everyone. You deserve to go to a better school. I feel like she and Daichi should uh, team up. I haven't seen the ghosts as much as I did last playthrough, or am I just imagining that? Oh wait, I need to shut this door. There we go. I had to just close it behind me and then I can leave, you know, through the other area. Is there anything in here? This one might be empty. 
because I've already gotten both of their journals for this floor. Freaking slow flashlight. I hate you. Okay, well, guess there's nothing in here. Close the door, close the door. Yep, yep. <laughs> I did close the door for the other ones, I'm quite sure. Yeah, I did close the door, so we're good there. Wait, what the? Hmm. Okay, next stop, third floor. And we'll be able to get into that secret room. It's the one with that poster with the musical note on it. Oh wait, where's the next emblem before I forget? 3-3, three, three, next to the teacher's podium. All right, I think that's one I got last time, too. I must have missed one of the teacher's journal. That's probably what screwed me out of getting the good ending, which is a horrible shame, but it's also the story of my life. Here we go. Okay, so behold, it's locked. However... Oh, wait, do I click on the poster or the door? I'm supposed to spam click something. Or does that only work once I have the key? Okay, tell you what, I'll come back with the key. It may only work if you've got the key for this floor. Ah. Bing bong, bing bong. That's what the school bells sound like. Yep, pretty much. It's a pleasant tune, but the problem is I've heard it in so many horror Oh God, why did that, I, what coming in just looked like a skeleton, it was weird, I don't know. Um, I've heard it so much in, in so many horror settings that, um, that it just doesn't sound as nice as it should. There we go. Yep, time to talk to them or their parents, cool. I wonder if the ghost girl appeared, like, well, she's only appeared once, hasn't she? I wonder if that happened because I stepped on the freaking manhole. That has to be it. Okay, I think it's in here. Yeah, there we go. There's the emblem. Let me make sure I'm not missing the next one. Ooh, there's two. There's three, two. Um, in the classroom, three, two, there's another one. Hmm. All right, magazine. It'd be really great if I could see more with this freaking flashlight. Okay, I don't think there's any journals in this room. Ugh, gotta close the door. Wait, did I close the teacher room door? I don't think I did. Doors, you're right, you're right. Oh, sorry, I looked at chat for the first time. <laughs> Thank you for the reminder. Yeah. Good job, guys. Teamwork. You'll keep me alive, right? <laughs> Okay, so that door is good. That's 3-3. Three, three. Door there is closed. Already been in there. That door is closed. Okay, 3-2 is where the next thing could be. Ah, there we go. Secret room opened. Yeah. Researcher, yep. Ichigo.art.blog. Okay, there you go. Is that the only payoff? It should be like the ghost breakdancing, just seizuring all over the place. That should be the reward. And then just have music pop up and lights. All right, fine. I guess that's it then. Classroom 3-2 will have something, if I'm not mistaken. Your spam clicking is pathetically slow. Well. It's not like I'm purposefully going quickly. Three, two, here we go. So there should be another one in here. Somewhere. Yeah, she's not here anymore. Last time I came into this room, she was just floating there. And there it is. 
I'm pretty sure I saw her just floating in the middle of the, the suitcases. I remember that vividly from my first playthrough. She's really not popping up, and I don't know why. I haven't done anything different other than not step on the manhole. Hmm. I have a feeling I should probably try getting that one achievement for clicking on 30 objects. So I guess I'll try doing that every time I pass a locked door. Is Daichi not a ghost? Did he not kill himself either? Because he, out of the two of them, he would be the one that I, I would think would have committed suicide. Because he feels he's a burden to his family. 4-3, on one of the top shelves. Yeah, I think I found that one last time. I only missed one emblem, and I only missed one journal in my last playthrough. That sucks, I got so close. I guess if I weren't reading the journals, she would attack me. Maybe I should try playing it one more time, except not touching any of the journals and just going for the key each time. I wonder if she would get angrier and angrier and appear more and more. Because it's probably because I forgot that first teacher's journal. Actually, that's probably why she, she started showing up. Hmm. All right. Guess we'll just head on to the end of the hall. You missed the best emblem. Fire emblem. Yeah, it is the world's greatest MacGuffin, I guess. The janitor haunts the school. Oh man, could you imagine the guy from White Day, the janitor just running out at you and just beating you with that stick like he did in that other game? Ah. The janitor was one of the scariest things in that freaking game, honestly. Hi there, good morning. Did I miss anything? Oh, uh, we're trying to get the true ending to a scary game I played. I played it once, got the bad ending, and now I'm playing it again. So, um, yeah, you're not missing much. It's just a school, and it, it kind of delves into the issues of, um... Oh, look at that. A little bit of a lighting issue there. I wonder what's causing that. Hmm. Weird bug. Yeah, so school issues, ghosts, <laughs> freaking ghost snitch. Okay, so do we have a problem with uh, the way the school is right now? All right, now where is that last emblem? 4-3, classroom 4-3, okay. You and your phobia of janitors, listen. Janitors are a lot like butlers. If something bad happens, they're usually behind it, okay? It's funny. All right, classroom 4-3, wait, I closed it behind, yeah, I did, okay, I did. Good eye, by the way, when I when I um, didn't close it behind me that other time. 4-3. Is that not the one I'm supposed to get into? Did I not pick up the key? Hang on, did I not pick up the key? Twist, you are the janitor, and this, these are his flashbacks. So we became a janitor at the school to stay with our ghost waifu? Is that what happened? Yeah, I did pick up the key. I wonder why 4-3... It, it must have been like the classroom after 4-3. I tend to only read the first four words and then drop off, and that usually causes a lot of misunderstandings when I'm streaming. If you get rich, better hope no janitors or butlers have watched this video. Oh no, I'm gonna tell them exactly that I don't trust them. That way, if they think that they can murder me, they're gonna have a harder time with it. Alright, the emblem in class 4-3 on top of the shelves there. But this is class 4-3. Did... I've got the key. I know I do. Maybe I have to go to a different one first. Guys, did I forget something? Okay, well, one of them is opening. Scholar. Good, I've got them all. Just an obstacle. I better quit my studies. Key, study classroom. Okay, so that's that explains it. I can't believe I forgot that from, since playing it for the first time. I, I, was, I was a little bit too scared to really take in much. This looks like the teacher's journal, but it doesn't allow me to really interact with it. Ah. Uh, oh, that Unity sale is over. Thank God, because I put, <laughs> just kept sinking money into it, so. Yeah. On the bright side, I might be able to make a little something-something. Right now, though, it's not going to come together unless I can get that stupid uh, 3D model's hair curly. God, that is hard to model in low poly, you know? Okay, there we go. Okay, so here are the exam papers, and of course... Wasn't there like a clock room? 
I guess the room didn't change all the way because uh, the girl, ghost girl hasn't been making... Oh, Collector, I got the achievement. The ghost girl hasn't been uh, making as many appearances. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so... Who'd have known? If I had just collected the right journals and the right emblems, I never would have even seen a ghost my first time here. That wouldn't have been nearly as scary, though, as a thing. Snitch. That did scare me, though. That scared me a lot. Because <laughs> she hasn't shown up until then. In this playthrough, really. Okay, time to go. I got everything, right? Got all the emblems, got the secret room. Fuck you. Got the, um, got the journals. Yeah. I'm really tempted to just do a little bit of a playthrough where I don't collect a single journal. But then that would be really scary, because what, what if she's really pissed off and she actually does kill you? What were you saying about not seeing the ghost? Saying the ghost is a snitch that's gonna get some stitches. Okay, here we go. I closed that door behind me, right? I think so. I don't know if anything of what I saw or read in the school was real. In any case, I've got the exams, so it's time to go back to Mitsuki and Sochiro. Next day, the teachers gathered the three of us. What? We were told that someone had informed them during the night that we broke into the school. As a punishment, we would have a penalty in our final grades, and they would also inform our parents to tell them what happened. The exam's content would be changed as well. How's that possible? Who blew the whistle? In any case, I'd better get ready for when I come back home. I got the bad ending anyway? She still snitched. I don't understand. What am I doing wrong? I got everything I possibly could have. What did I do wrong? Okay, hang on. Maybe you forgot a door. Uh, did I? Ghost wife who has no chill. Okay, we'll tell you what, just stare at that for a second. I'm gonna see, because I got all the journals. You think that would have made a big difference? Hmm. I mean, all it does is change a single, a single screen of dialogue at the very end. I don't understand. What did I do wrong? No, you got everything. I think it's a missed flag or something like that. Maybe. Maybe Mr. Craven got it. <sighs> the models were stock assets from a program called Vroid. I see, that explains why they're so kind of pop star anime-ish. Yeah, I don't know what I did wrong. I... I don't know. Maybe I have to purposely not read all the journals or something. Mr. Craven, as in Craven the Hunter. I don't know, the, the guy with the beard. He does uh, a lot of unique horror games, so... I haven't seen him uh, much in the last year or so, but he, if I remember right, he does a bunch of cool stuff. don't know exactly what it was that I did wrong. Well, I've played it for like two hours now. I got all the stuff. It must have just been an issue with the flags like somebody pointed out. Well, not bad. I did get it for free anyway, so, you know. Um, 
But yeah, I guess that's where we are right now. Oh gosh, wait, Arch- uh, Arch- uh, Archive Fate Rider with, <laughs> with uh, let's just round that up to one money. Thank you very much. Yeah, it looks like everyone's kind of puzzled. Try not to touch anything. I guess technically you did move things by reading and taking emblems. Yeah, yeah, he's still posting videos. Yeah, I assumed. It's just that I haven't been keeping up with a lot of stuff. I've been a bit busy since the year started. Um. Oh, you didn't miss it. Don't worry. Believe me, this playthrough was practically identical, identical to the first playthrough I did of it. Anyways, just just something quick to do, because uh, right now I'm, I'm knee-deep in preparing stuff. By the way, if anyone didn't hear me when I started the stream, um, it might be a good idea to grab some extra meat items and then just throw them in a freezer to freeze, because at least where I am, uh, my country, there's possible meat shortages. Um, and I know the president has come out saying that they're not going to be, that he's going to try and keep the factories open. But again, if all the, if all the workers get sick, that's still going to cause a bunch of issues. And if stores are closed, that's also going to cause a bit, bunch of issues. Um, so what I would recommend is get some like sausage, some bacon, just throw it in the freezer and then whip it out every couple weeks. And then that way, if you're in quarantine for another two to three months, at least you'll, you know, have some stuff. We like to get the, the, the sausage and then um, like kind of cut it up and throw it to, to sear in a pan and then throw bell peppers in there and just sear it up. And it's really nice. Spam is actually pretty good too. If you slice it thinly and then fry it in a pan and then, you know, eat it together with like eggs and, and other dishes it's really nice i wouldn't recommend eating it alone unless you really like it or you know you don't have anything else but yeah want me to send you some steaks oh no not your cows uh no thank you i guess you won't have an issue with the meat but yeah uh for the rest of you if you're thinking about it next time you're at the store maybe toss a few things in because um i feel like there could be a shortage and you know that's just me thinking something i'm wrong a lot as you as you can see here but it's just something to think about spam is good it depends i i actually i actually like it you know um but it's all in how you cook it like if you just peel the top off and start eating it with a spoon unless unless you just like spam it's not going to be very good but if you take it out and slice it into thin rectangles you can fry it in a pan and it's 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 a little bit like bacon when you do that it's nice also stock up on tinned tomatoes and stuff yeah yeah we just got a bunch of uh, jarred stuff and and canned vegetables and fruit cups and stuff stuff that that can stay on the shelf for a couple months um what i would also recommend is um oh i went to my walmart the other day here let me just get rid of the screen since we know i will get a little jamaica going too that should be fun there we go just talking music yeah, I went to my Walmart, um, all the ramen was gone, except of course for the shrimp ramen. The Nobody seemed to want the shrimp ramen, which who could blame them? But another thing was, all the flour was gone too, like all of it, the entire shelf was bare, so no flour, and there was no yeast either. So if, you, if you're trying to break, bake your own stuff, um, like my family does, we have our own yeast cultures and we, we bake stuff, um, be careful, try and stock up on that, like an extra bag of flour or yeast or rice or something. So when is your Zombies Ate My Neighbors playthrough? Just kidding. Um, that's a good one for co-op, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, I've heard of that one. Let's see. I went and got food. Is the stream over? Yeah, I got the bad ending, even though I tried really hard. I don't know what, what the deciding factor in getting the good ending is. Oh, uh, oh, and here's another thing. If you go to your Walmart to get ramen and it's all gone, go to the ethnic aisle. They've got a bunch of, uh, a little bit of a different ramen there, like the hot and spicy. It's got a blue and uh, white and green kind of color packaging. Load up on those um, because I noticed while all the ramen in the, you know, regular ramen section was gone, the ethnic foods had ramen there on the bottom shelf. I guess people just didn't think that ramen would be in two places at the store. So, yeah. <sighs> International aisle, yeah, yeah. Lots of people avoid that or just don't know what to do with that stuff, so you can always find all sorts of cool stuff there. Like, there's sauerkraut, prepared red cabbage, you know, jarred stuff that, you know, clearly are important so that they have to have a better shelf life than some, you know, good stuff. As an ex-Walmart employee, be careful with the ramens and breads at the back as they are most commonly eaten by rats. Yeah, uh, I haven't seen any in my store, that's probably just luck, but yeah, um... I don't know if it's at the back of the shelf, but it, they're they're on the lower shelves rather than, you know, in the back. Oh boy, rats. You remember finding a rat once during my retail days? <laughs> 
we went to um, Costco too. You could still order food at the food court, but they took away all the tables and stuff. So you couldn't actually eat in the store. And they wouldn't let you in the building unless you had a face covering, which was good because I brought an N95 mask anyway. And they were only letting, um, you know, like 25% uh, of the capacity in the store. So, you know, crazy stuff, crazy stuff. <sighs> yeah, so jarred olives, canned olives. Um, I know at Walmart specifically, they have these really nice soups that come in these pouches, and they last for years if you don't get to them. Um, I think it's Bear Creek or something, and they've got like loaded potato soup, creamy cheddar, you know, chili, whatever, whatever. Um, so that's an idea too, if you need something to stick around. My favorite drink is from the International Isle is, is called Lot Milkus. Really? Huh. Never heard of that one. Have been buying a bunch of Nido though, because um, this is the first time we've been out of quarantine in like two months, I'd say. And the only reason we went is because we heard that the governor is opening up our state. So we're like, we should go out and buy stuff before, you know, the floodgates open and everyone starts trying to go back to regular life. So that's why we were out the other day. There's still a few more things I need to pick up before everything opens up again. But yeah, it's for another day, I guess. Chickpeas, amazing for many meals, yeah. You can still buy pasta and things. Well, that's very good. Hopefully it stays that way for you. Potato soup is really good. Yep, yep. You can use some Nido yourself. Yeah, we bought a couple. We went back. They were all gone, all of them. And it was like, what? They finally had some back today, which is good. So we picked up like two or three cans. Because it's not like we're going out for daily milk. You know what I mean? We're going to have to mix up the powdered stuff, which is awful. But, I mean, we need to bake with something, right? So... Winco was pretty good for anyone planning to buy in bulk. Oh yeah, I loved Winco. I went up to the, the northern kind of middle of America and they had those there. And I went nuts uh, for the really long gummy worms and the giant hunks of chocolate. They had a bunch of cool stuff there. I got some stuff in your state. Uh, it's going to get worse and very quickly. Yeah, and not to mention, one of the other reasons I did this is because I believe that they're reopening a bit too soon. I mean, I guess you can't keep it closed indefinitely, but I do feel strongly that reopening is probably going to cause some flare-ups, which you don't want to be out and about trying to get stuff if you're starving, if there's flare-ups going around and people are getting sicker again and out in groups. So again, you know, just if you have the money or the time or the means, it's a good idea to protect yourself by stocking up when you can. Me for president? Ugh, oh, politics make me so sick. I, I can't stand anyone associated with politics, honestly. Everyone's just either... I'm not going to talk about it, but yeah, not a big fan of politics. Uh, what is a Winco? A store? Yeah, it's it's basically kind of like a Costco, but they have these giant barrels full of bulk items that you can take scoops and put them into bags, and they sell it by the weight. Um, if you just Google, like, Winco um, barrels or something, you can see what, what the food looks like. It's pretty cool. And it's tons of junk, like seeds, coffee beans. Uh, I really like the, the the green and brown, the mint mint chocolate covered uh, crunchy things. Those are kind of fun. Speaking of game soup and playing the long dark, huh? Super hard. Why does that sound familiar? The long dark. The long dark. I think. Do I have that game? I think I got it on for on sale for PS4 once. I got that on sale and I was like, this will be great for the channel, and then I went away for a while. Oh wait, it may not be the Long Dark, it may be that one that starts with K, which is very similar to Long Dark. It's like Kabbalah or Kalda or something. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Uh, I am going to go ahead and... I, I just reali realized I may not be able to show you, because I don't really feel comfortable showing somebody else's playthrough um, on YouTube, because, you know, they worked hard for that, um, and it's their footage. Um, but let me read you what the good endings thing is. Okay, here we go. Okay, so like I said, it's only difference and like a little bit of text at the end. I don't know if anything of what I saw or read in the school was real. In any case, I've got the exams, so it's time to go back to Mitsuki and Sochiro. Next day, the teachers gathered the three of us. We were told that... Someone had informed them during the night that we broke into the school. Despite having committed an infraction, they decided to ignore it. They had a meeting prior to calling us, and they realized that we were under a lot of pressure. Therefore, they would look for different options to reduce our workload and their demands. Did we do well? Seems like yes, but what really happened last night? So she snitches on us even in the good ending. Ghost girl, you suck. Ah, 
Okay, so that that's it. That is really the only difference between them. There you go. Credit them? Oh yeah, um uh IGXL Insane Gaming. If you just Google Ju uh Juken Jigoku good ending, um they're the ones that come up. So that's IGXL Insane Gaming XL. A lot of XLs. I wonder what they did to get that. Oh well, oh well. All right, well, you know what? I think we'll end it there. I uh, hope everyone's having a good week. I'll probably do something again in a day or so. Next week's going to be a bit crazy. Um, some friends of mine are unfortunately moving, and uh, I'm helping out a bit with that. So, uh, yeah. But anyway, uh, thank you for coming by, and hope everyone enjoyed the stream. And Oh, wait, why does it say stream break? It should have said stream over. Ah, what he told me. All right, thank you so much. I uh, hope everyone has a good rest of your week. Stay safe, stay healthy. Um, hopefully you're eating well. And um, see you next time. Hopefully I won't miss the, the half of the next one. Yes, yeah, because you're partying too much. You're sleeping in because of that. <laughs> but yeah, no worries. Again, you missed practically nothing. I was just super scared in the first playthrough and I drew, drug it out because I was procrastinating and afraid. So that's about it. All right, bye-bye. Oh, the Discord. If you want to join the Discord, the link is in the description. Um, sometimes we do movie nights and we watch them and then we make fun of them in the chat. <laughs>